Hello, welcome to Enox Engineering. I'm Alan. As you can see, we're starting in the workshop and I'm looking at the CNC machine today. I haven't used it for a few months, so I thought I'd just give it a run, make sure it's working okay. The weather's improved, it's not so cold in here now. Uh, what I'll be making today is what I call a maker's plate. It's just a small plate that you have your name or your company logo on to fit on any uh, equipment that you make. And what I'm making it out of is this piece of aluminium which is a UK registration plate for cars. It's yellow on one side, that's the reflective plate. But the back is uh, stuck onto an aluminium and that's ideal for making small projects. We found this in a scrap bin, uh, quite a few of them. Uh, just a shame to scrap them off, the aluminium comes in useful. So let's get the machine fired up and see how we do it. Keep the computer in this cabinet and we have, it's an old computer running Windows XP. It's not connected to the internet or email. It's a standalone unit and all I use it for is running the CNC. This next to it, it's a computer case but inside it's got the electronics for the CNC machine and the interfaces to the computer and then on the top of the table I've got the screen and the keyboard's kept in this drawer, standard keyboard. I've also got a USB port here which I plug in the memory stick and this games controller that I use to control the machine. This is the drawing of what I wanted to make with Enox Engineering on and the way I've done that is draw across and draw all the other lines and they come onto this side here all listed there the text and this this line on the orange line on the outside is the material size and once you've drawn the item it's only obviously a 2D drawing you get your th third dimension by saying how deep you want the cutter to go on the various features and to start the machine I'm going to Mac 3 select it mill CMC the program loads I press the reset then what I can do is load the g-code and it loads it up here I haven't set the axes yet and that's how I get the program into the computer for the CNC so let's cut some metal
Oh well, that's it for this week. I hope you found that interesting, and if you did, why not subscribe? And we'll see you next time on Enots Engineering.